Conditional statements are an essential part of programming in Roblox. They allow you to execute different blocks of code depending on whenever a certain condition is true or false. In this tutorial, we will cover the basis of conditional statements in Roblox using the Lua programming language. A question you might be asking yourself is, what is a conditional statement, or what are conditional statements? Conditional statements are used to execute different blocks of code depending on whenever a certain condition is true or false. In Roblox, the most common conditional statement is the if statement. Here's an example. Now let's use a visual representation here. So let's make a character and let's set their age to like 21 or 22. And they wanna ask ourselves if our age is greater than or equal to 18, then we wanna tell the console that we're an adult. In this example, we declare a variable age and assign it to the value of 18. Then we use an if statement to check if age is greater than or equal to 18. If it is, we print the message you're an adult to the console. How to use conditional statements in Roblox. In Roblox, you can use the following conditional statements. If statement, executes a block of code if a condition is true. If else statement, executes one block of code if a condition is true and another block of code if it is false. If else if else statement, executes one block of code if a condition is true, another block of code if the other condition is true, and a default block of code if none of the conditions are true. Here's an example of an if else statement. All right, now let's get our character back in here. And now let's set his age to 16. And now if we put it back into the same conditional statement, we're gonna have, you're an adult, and we're gonna have, you're a minor. And what do you think is gonna fire if our age is now 16? If you said you're a minor, you were correct. Hooray! <laughs> it's gonna fire that because the else statement's gonna pass because the first conditional statement is false. So it fires the else statement because of the fact that our age is less than 18 or equal to 18. In this example, we declare a variable age and assign it to the value of 16. Then we use an if else statement to check if age is greater than or equal to 18. If it is, we print the message, you're an adult to the console. If it is not, we print the message, you're a minor to the console. Now to logical operators. In addition to conditional statements, you can also use logical operators to combine conditionals. The most common logical operators are an operator, returns true if both conditions are true, or operator, returns true if either condition is true, and the not operator, returns true if the condition is false. Here's an example of the an operator. In this example, we declare a variable age and assign it to the value of 20. We also declare a variable is student and assign it to the value of true. We then use an if statement and with the and operator to check if age is greater than or equal to 18 and is student is true. If both conditions are true, we print the message, you're an adult student to the console. The or operator. In this example, we declare a variable age and assign it to the value of 16. We also declare a variable is student and assign it to the value of true. And if, and we use an if statement with the or operator to check if the age is greater than or equal to 18 or is student is true. If either condition is true, we print the message, you're an adult student to the console. The not operator. In this example, we declare a variable is student and assign it to the value of false. We then use an if statement with the not operator to check if, to check if is student is false. If it is, we print the message, you are not a student to the console. To end off this video, conditional statements are an essential part of programming in Roblox. They allow you to execute different blocks of code depending on whenever a certain condition is true or false. In this tutorial, we cover the basics of conditional statements in Roblox using the Lua U programming language. Time for the challenge question. Looking at this piece of code, what do you think is going to print out to the console if I was to run this in Roblox Lua right now? All right, now after you solve that, now what do you think is gonna fire if I change this variable? Put your answer down below. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, thanks for watching. We're gonna be putting more tutorials out and enjoy your day, thank you.